off at the Bulldogs since moving from the Eagles. Please welcome Kobe Stevens to Marnbrook. Yeah. Yeah. Welcome, Kobe, and great Thanks to have you on. Uh, how are you enjoying your first season at the Bulldogs? Yeah, it's been a bit of a change coming back from the West, but, um, you know, it's been great. I've played more games of footy this year than in my whole career over at West Coast Eagles. So, yeah, it's been a great experience this year. And you're happy to be back home in Victoria because you're originally from Gippsland. Yeah, originally from Gippsland. Uh, it's very good being back. Obviously, all my family and uh, friends are from Victoria, so it's good to get home and be able to see them and spend a lot more time with them than I was able to while I was over in Western Australia. So, yeah. Yeah, Kobe, thanks for coming on the show. It's good to have you on the show. One thing I want to know about the Bulldogs, how much he's <coughs> progressed in the last uh, five to six weeks. And the way he's come out at the start of the year, he's getting a lot of flack from a lot of people. Even the uh, poor old coach was getting a bit of flack. But I'll tell you something, the last five or six weeks, you have been terrific, mate. And all, it must be enjoyable at uh, Witten Oval. Yeah, obviously, uh, the start of the year, we, we started off very well, come out in round one and played some really good footy against Brisbane. And uh, a lot of things went downhill from there on. We uh, had a lot of injuries and um, probably weren't playing the footy we wanted to play. And... Obviously, it was it was a very hard time there for about uh, three months. But was there um, any one thing that changed? What can you um, think not of? Not so much. Just... Uh, Mac is a great teacher of the game, and he was you know preaching the same things week in and week out. And obviously, we started to gel a lot better as a group. We had a, you know a lot of young blokes come into the side. I think at one stage we had 15 guys under 50 games. So you know it's a it's a pretty big thing to have that many young blokes in the side. And, you know, we started to gel a lot better and started to get our contested footy and started converting that into uncontested footy. So, you know, we got a lot more dangerous around, around the footy. We weren't just, uh, you know, one-dimensional side that we kind of were in the first few weeks.